You're launching the Snapdragon 800. Yes. So we announced the series on Monday during Paul Jacobs' keynote. We had a great keynote there, and we're excited to be here at CES showing Snapdragon 800. We've got a variety of demonstrations. We've got multimedia demos doing Ultra HD, so that's 4K, so that's four times 1080p, as well as yeah, 4K video playback. Our, off a tablet, off our Snapdragon 800 tablet, we're showing video playback. Our processor also supports encode, so think of being able to encode, instead of using your camera you're using right now, think of being able to do it at 4K. You can encode 4K video. Yes, as well as decode, yes. So basically all the smartphones, tablets, with the, this new processor of 4K cameras. Correct, you got it. Just build in. Yep, That's and add 7.1 to that, and you get a really great home theater experience so you can do things either yourself or you know watch a movie so that's awesome so what kind of demos do you have here? we've got a lot of other demos we've got gaming so let's walk this way this is all these are yes there's a lot of great things with snapdragon 800 so we've got gaming they've got some great games here that we've optimized for snapdragon 800 so showing off the value of our new GPU that's in here. This is Adreno 330, so two times the processing power of our previous generation. Two times, double. Two times, double. Double the texture complexity and all that stuff. Yes. But it's still 1080p games, or what is it? So, so, that, so that, this is the GPU, yes. Our processor supports 1080p as well as 4K. So that's a... Uh more the, the same games just more beautiful or newer games uh -huh. it could be new games too the can be new games too yeah of course and then of course we have other features so we've got camera functionality he's actually showing object removal and cloning and so he's actually going to remove it just his head yeah so and look at that i just chopped off his head <laughs> but i have his head here let me chop half of his body this time. So this is actually using the GPU. Yes. Uh, sure, I'm doing this at the same time. <laughs> we made some compensation here. Because our GPU GPU processor understands all the surroundings. So after the move. We do, we do some compensation. So that's taking advantage of the new GPU as well. And then we've also, so in here we've got DTS, and here we're showing Dolby. So we support both Dolby and DTS, and really excited to work with both of them on great audio. So you know, you really want a good... So you're showing like uh, with headphones? Yes, this is Dolby DS1. Right. So think of, you know, watching a movie and being able to really get a good experience on that. And the last thing we have is video, and here we're showing that we do H.265 and 264. 265 is much better, you know, you're getting the same quality, and so from a carrier perspective, you really want, you're excited about moving to new video codecs and having new standards. That's like the HEVC. Exactly, that's exactly that's what that is. And this is at 1080p. 1080p, super smooth. Yep. No problems decoding no. the no highest problem. uh, profiles of that, the highest bit rates. And the exactly. Highest bit rates. So we're actually showing that the file size is much smaller and you really can look and see that the quality is the same, very similar. So it's uh, 4 megabit versus 6 megabit. And the uh, quality is maybe even better. Yep. Cool. So these are all the multimedia features. There's a lot of other things that's special about Snapdragon 800 as well. Big thing, of course, is Support for Cat4, so LTE up to 150 megabits per second. We're actually demonstrating that right over here as well. On the downlink, uh huh. Uh, no, Cat3 is 100. So now we're doing 150. And so we actually have four different, oh, excuse me, three different 1080p videos playing. We're surfing the web. We're using, as you can see, the downlink is fluctuating from 100 to up close to 150 at times. Does that require a new infrastructure all over the world? I mean, all over the yes, country? Yes, yeah, the carriers will move to Cat4. You need to upgrade, yep. upgrade the OTC? Yeah. And of course, we also support AC in our chipset. So really, you can do not only LTE, but AC, so you can really have a good experience with getting content. Peut-être en apprendre à connaître. Je me révèle petit à petit. 
parfois ce n'est pas à mon, à mon avantage, certes. Mais j'aime trop dans un sens sortir ou avoir ma propre vie, ma propre indépendance.